pigeon stories. All right. Well, the pigeon needs a bath. I do not, he says. <laughs> Hi. I don't know if you've noticed, but the pigeon is filthy. So I could use your help because the pigeon needs a bath. That is a matter of opinion. What a kidder. I don't really need a bath. I took one last month. I think it was last month. Clean, dirty, they're just words, right? I feel clean. Maybe you need a bath. Yeah, when I was, when was the last time you had a bath? Oh, that was pretty recently. Life is so short, why waste it on unimportant things like taking a bath? What smell? I don't smell anything. <laughs> And if I do, it's a very normal smell for a pigeon. You know, in some places it's impolite to bathe. I don't want to be in those places. All of these flies buzzing around me are purely coincidental. <laughs> hey, you. Yuck. Let's get out of here, the flies say. Take a bath, dude. Okay, fine. If it means so much to you, I'll take a bath. Whoa. I'm not gonna like this one bit. The water is too hot. It's too cold. Too lukewarm. Too hot. Too wet. Too cold. Not enough toys. Okay, too many toys. Too deep. Not deep enough. Too cold. Now it's too hot again. Too reflective. That's still too hot. Well, this is okay, I guess. Splash. He's diving in the bathtub. Hey, this is fun. Wash, wash, washy. La la la, sing in the tub. Ah, this is the life. I love bubbles. Look at my wrinkly toes. Hello, hello, how are you? I'm fine. I'm a fish, I'm a fish. Ten hours later. Can I stay in the tub forever? He does. The end. <laughs>